You ask, we investigate. Regina is a single mom who's been trying to get her landlord to fix problems for years. Well, tonight she called us for help. Steve Shamraz live in Milwaukee. And Steve, what did you find out? Carol, we found this. It's a list of code violations and in order to get these all cleaned up in about a month, now it comes down to the word of the landlord and whether he'll finally get this job done. Regina Rogers lived in this apartment nearly three years, waiting for her landlord to make good on his word. When I came in, I noticed that there were some issues and he promised that he would fix the uh, do maintenance. Problems like a broken window held together with tape, a busted heating register big enough for her three-year-old son to climb into, and windows that leak cold air like sieves. So, how bad did the drafts get in here? Oh, very bad, very bad. Um, we generally have to crank the heat up till about 80, 85. Earlier this month, Rozier had enough and reported her landlord to the city. An inspector came out and wrote up 22 code violations. The landlord, as luck has it, lives just downstairs, but he would not come to the door. Hi, Mr. Jackson, Steve Shamraz over at Channel 4. Though we did reach him on the phone. Frederick Jackson would not let us put his voice on the air, but made us a promise, too. The inspector granted me 30 days to have them repaired, he said, and they'll be fixed well within the 30 days. If we come back in a month, this will all be taken care of? He promised us again. You can put my life on it. And we will see if Regina's landlord makes good on his word this time. We'll check back in the next 30 days to see if this list of problems has finally been fixed. Live in Milwaukee tonight, Steve Shambras, today's TMJ4. Well, at least he made a promise. Thank you, Steve. You ask, we investigate. Contact our news team by going to tmj4.com slash tips.